the very first thing, I'm going to cover three success secrets, and I covered some of these um, uh, actually, let's see, my slides are going nutty here. Okay, here we go. Uh, I covered some of these in some of my free presentations, uh, but not all of them, and I, I just want to run through them quick because they are so important. You've got to make a commitment starting today that you're not going to do campaigns anymore. You won't do any strategies. You won't take on consulting jobs without thinking about mobile as just a necessary part of it. It's not optional. It's not something that you might do here, there, and maybe sometimes. You just do it on every one. It's as important as any other part of a campaign that you, uh, you know, might do. Okay? You wouldn't go design business cards and then leave out the part of taking it to the printer. It's that important. You have to include it. So everything that you do that's associated with a campaign, try to make it mobile. And I'm going to show you all of those ways as we go forward here. The second thing, and this is more important, I think, in mobile than it is in Internet marketing, uh, that is you've got to think compelling all the time. And by compelling, it's as if though if what you're offering your customer isn't compelling to them as they uh, interact with your campaign uh, in their mobile state or, you know, wherever they're at, uh, you know, out and about, if it's not compelling to them in that situation, then it's not going to work. So really one part of your success in mobile is going, going to be uh, figuring out how to make whatever it is you do, whatever it is you sell, make it compelling to a customer when he's on the go, when she's on the go. That's important. And so that's going to require some thinking. You know, if, if you, you just take your product, uh, I'll give you some uh, points in a moment, but you'll take your product and you can say, okay, if a person were mobile, what could I do, uh, you know, related to my product to make them feel as though I'm, I'm serving them something that um, uh, needs to be on mobile, that they would want to get on mobile, uh, things of that nature. We're going to go into details on that later, but you've got to become compelling. That's the trick to being successful in mobile. On the Internet, you know, you can kind of throw anything out there and some things stick, some things don't. On mobile, you've got to think it through and make sure you're giving them what they want. When people walk into an ice cream store, what do they want? Ice cream. You can't serve them, you know, chili. That's not what they're in the mood for. When a person's on a mobile device, what do they want? Mobile content, mobile delivery of whatever they've bought, mobile stuff, stuff that will help them while they're out and about on the go. The next thing has to do with value. You've got to give more value than you do in any other mode. You need to add so much value to your to whatever your target uh, you know, customer or audience wants, that they literally will fall in love with you. And they'll like you because you're delivering to them what they want in the mobile um, uh, environment that they love so much. So you're going to have to think about things like really upsing your customer support, really thinking about you know, how your product or your service uh, can be of benefit to someone when they're out there on the go. And if you do this, they will fall in love with you. They will love to receive your text messages. You'll be sending less of them rather than more of them because you're, you'll just be effective with what you do. And they will share it with other people 